Yet here all of a sudden, time as we know it has become formless. And the great big Ben folds slowly like marshmallow, melting and flowing into itself. Who'd have thought a disease would have the power to freeze the clock? I wonder how you two will look back at this moment in the future. I don't think it's over by a long shot. The next chapter in this comic is just being written. And nobody's laughing. Because they can't see the boogeyman. How do so many governments have capital, stockpiles and contingency for war? but no real plan to protect the people they serve in the event of a pandemic. This disease doesn't care who its victims are. Our government and plenty others continue to put profit over people, convincing us to go to restaurants while poorer families dealt the worst conditions are left to fend for themselves. If this year were to be thought of symbolically, maybe this disease has exposed truths that have been long buried beneath the carpet. Truths that might not be able to live in the old world we inhabited. I am worried as if life wasn't hard enough for us before. We make 3% of this island nation's population, but we're four more times likely to die from this disease. How can that be anything other than the legacy of racism manifested 